Can't believe you're packing your bags Trying so hard not to cry Had the best time and now it's the worst time But we have to say goodbye Don't promise that you're gonna ride Don't promise that you'll call Just promise Hey wig friends, I'm Nikki and welcome back to my channel. I hope everybody had a wonderful Thanksgiving and got plenty to eat. I know I certainly did, it's showing, but it's the one holiday I love to indulge in with food. And I have got my wig cap on, which means I'm here to bring you a wig review. I upload every Monday, Thursday, and Friday, but I like to throw these surprise uploads in there now and then, especially when it's a new release. And I hinted not too long ago that I ordered quite a few new releases. And the last of them finally arrived in the mail today. So just a little heads up. You'll be seeing me almost every day until I can get through these because I want you to know about them ASAP. And that's also why you need to join the party and subscribe so you don't miss any of my upcoming videos. If you already have subscribed, thank you so much. I truly do appreciate it. Don't forget to go down in the comments and give me your respectful feedback and let me know if there's a wig you'd like me to review. So today I have got a Bobby Boss, and you're going to make me try to pronounce this name. Sayaran? Sayaran? I honestly don't know how to pronounce this one. C-I-A-R-A-N. And she's a lace front from the Soft Wave series. I have in the color TT01B slash FHBL. She comes in several other colors. She's a free position wig, so you can shift her. Her parting space is four and a half inches deep and her lace is HD. She is also heat safe and I picked her up from Elevate Styles for $29.99. Those are some pretty waves. Look at these. Oh, very bouncy. And let's take a look at this HD lace. Not bad. I am a little concerned though about these knots. You see those there? That might be harder for me to blend. We shall see. Let's take a look at her cap construction. Parting space. She does have combs. One here and one over here. There is also one here in the back. She does come with adjustable straps. You can see what this lining is, the pretty standard kind. And let's see what her stretchability is like. It's uh, not too bad, but she looks to be about medium size. I'm not really sure if she will be larger head friendly based on the stretchability. But I will be back in a moment with her on and give you my final thoughts. All right, guys, here she is. Do not make me say her name again. I already butchered it enough, but... This is her. I'm a little disappointed though. She doesn't look as much like the stock card model as I was hoping, which unfortunately seems to be a common thing with Bobby Boss units lately. They need to work on that. But this is what I was hoping for. See these nice loose flowing curls and they're soft and you can see she's got some density too. But instead, that's what I got more of a curled up mess. I tried using a brush. I tried using my fingers. Tried using a comb. I honestly don't know what else I could try, but everything that I did resulted in the same thing here. Just bounced right back like this. So it's tighter and grouped together, not what I was looking for. But this isn't a bad look. I mean, if this is what you hope, you know, want, then yeah, you got it. Uh, you know, some people like to wear this for a formal event, that sort of thing. But her density, she's thin down here. Look at this. So you really have to fan her out. I mean, obviously she's got more up here with the layers, which this I think is good. But down here I don't. So honestly, I'm most likely I'm going to trim her. I think that if I were to trim her up to this other layer, that would be better. I just think this would be a better length. Just my opinion. Obviously, you don't have to cut her, but if you want to, that's an option at least. 
I do think she tangles a little bit too much than I was hoping for. So I think maybe if I do trimmer, that will help because the tangling seems to be mostly right down in here anyway. And then that will obviously make it more frayed and look frizzy. And yeah, I don't want that desired look. <laughs> so this color though, I think is gorgeous. I think it's a good fall hue color. Just kind of get that woodsy type nutty look to it. And it's got good contrast too, because you do have the frosted going on here with the 1B root and this beautiful shade of honey blonde. This is a stunning color. Really like it. Luster looks good and natural. It's what I'm looking for. Uh, shedding though is not an issue. Forgot to mention that. Sorry. Shedding's not that bad. Just the normal amount you would expect. And overall, I'm going to put her at about 26 inches long. So let me show you her from the side and the back. I think she looks better draped, just in my opinion. Texture does feel good. It is light yakky. It is soft. It feels very realistic. So I think the texture is one of the best things about her, along with this color, of course. <laughs> and since she is shiftable, that is a good quality, too. You have that versatility going on. I obviously just went with the right side. But she lays flat, so that is definitely positive for me. And I was very concerned about those knots. But you can still see some of them here in the parting space. But honestly, I think that if you use the right shade of powder or concealer, that might clear that up. But I was really worried about them right here in the front, and I don't really see them that much. So, not too concerned about it. Her sides are a bit thick, but not much lift up. So if you do want to tuck behind the ear, you could. That side, she doesn't come with many baby hairs though. She comes with a few right here, as you can see. So if you're one that likes to lay your baby hairs down, I think they could have done better. So you most likely have to use some of your own. But I don't know. I think I'm gonna like her more after I trim her. I am gonna keep her. I'm gonna give it a try, trim her up, see what I think about her then. But at this point, I still do recommend her because she does have a lot of good qualities. It's just more of a personal preference thing. If you don't really like this style, then obviously you wouldn't get her. But just know what to expect. Uh, so yeah, that's pretty much how I'm feeling about her. And I cannot wait to see what she looks like after I trim her. So now I'm excited. I'm going to go do that now, probably. But <laughs> I will be back soon with another video. Make sure you tell me your thoughts. Be respectful, of course. And I will see you very, very soon. Until then, bye-bye.